I am going to tell you about a nutrient that probably you and most Americans don't get enough of. This nutrient also affects many systems in your body, from reducing heart disease, preventing diabetes, improving your gut, even controlling your appetite and weight. Any idea what this nutrient is? Fiber, my friends. So what is fiber? Fiber is a carbohydrate, believe it or not, but they don't act like regular carbohydrates because they cannot be broken down and absorbed in the body. But you should know that all fibers are not created equal. Different types of fibers have different functions in your body. For this video, I have classified this complex nutrient into three types of fibers. The first type of fiber is called insoluble fiber. This fiber cleans the pipes. It does this by making food go through your intestines faster. Insoluble fibers help with preventing constipation, keeping your intestines clean, and preventing colon cancer. Insoluble fibers are mainly found in vegetables, seeds, and whole grains such as quinoa and brown rice, among other foods. The second type of fiber is soluble fiber. When you eat soluble fiber, it attracts water and turns into a gel during digestion. This gel slows digestion and it helps to control blood sugar, lowers cholesterol and keeps you full for a longer time. So where can you find soluble fibers? Beans, oats, applesauce, apples, among other foods. And the third type of fiber is prebiotic fiber. Although all prebiotics are fibers, not all fibers are prebiotic. In order to be prebiotic fiber, it must be fermentable by your gut bacteria and promote the growth and activity of the good bacteria in your gut, also known as probiotics. So this type of fiber feeds the probiotics to keep your gut healthy and prevent many chronic diseases such as metabolic syndrome, depression, to even obesity. Prebiotic fibers can be found in mangoes, walnuts, avocados, onions, and bananas, among other foods. Please note that some of these foods can contain two types of fiber or even all three types of fiber. So how much fiber do you need? Women need 25 grams, men need 30 grams per day. So you probably wonder, what about fiber supplements? Supplements have their place, but remember, food comes first. When you eat food, not only you eat the fiber, you also eat vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. For more information about weight loss, nutrition, and healthy living, visit manuelvillacorta.com.